What's up guys, it's Lee here and today we're going to talk about three styles of photo booth backdrops that will make your photo business a winner. Because you're a winner. Winner. Let's face it, gone are the days of the traditional black muslin backdrops. Out. Gone. Your clients want more, so let's give them more. I went to YouTube, Pinterest, Google, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, fabric stores, camera stores, and so much more. And at the end of the day, this is what I came up with. Number one, sequin. They scream glamour, glitz, beauty. So keep them close in your photo booth backdrop inventory. I myself have a rose gold sequin. I have a gold sequin, turquoise sequin, a white and champagne chevron sequin. If you're looking for some of the sequins that I mentioned, I'll put them in the link in the description. Backdrop two, this one's gonna excite you. Let's take it up a notch. So if grid arches aren't in your city yet, that's great. Then you can get there first. You ain't first. You can do so many things with a grid arch. You can stretch a sequin over the grid arch. You can attach a background balloon kit. You can charge big bucks to attach a background balloon kit. I also have some links for those balloon kits in the description. So this next one is great. So boxwood greenery panel backdrops have been all the craze for a few years now. There's nothing quite as fresh looking as a uh, boxwood backdrop. So here's an example of me bartending behind one of these backdrops. Just how stunning they can look. Okay, pro tip. So let's say you don't have the money to buy a boxwood backdrop. You can rent one from a local company. Pick up the phone, call a local company and see if they have it for rent. And then ask them if you can sub rent from them and uh, maybe use their picture, put it on your website and then uh, you can start upselling. You don't have to buy it. If people book it enough, then you go out and buy your own. Okay, so now that we've touched on three popular photo booth backdrops, I'm gonna share a little secret with you. Offer your clients add-ons. This may be the rental portion of me coming out, but that's one of my most successful portions, so why not? So the beauty about add-ons is you don't really have to own them. You can just uh, find something from another company and sub-rent it. So if you see a, uh, a nice chair that you can use in a backdrop uh, from another company, just take the picture of that, uh, put it on your website, and then uh, just, just rent it from the other person. Popular add-on items that uh, can be used in photos are barrels. Uh, you can call your local distillery and uh, see if they have any barrels for sale. So rustic doors is, a, is another great one. So when people are looking for rustic items, they're looking for like doors and stuff like that. So it's great to have some door add-ons. The best time to swipe these up are right in peak wedding season. So uh, right after the weekend when the bride already has their event, uh, the next coming Monday, uh, a lot of times they already have their stuff up for sale. And uh, what you have to do is just watch for it. Uh, and watch closely, set some notifications on your uh, Facebook so that uh, they'll pop up right when they go, uh, right when they get posted and uh, just, just snatch them up. All right, guys, thanks for tuning into my video. Uh, if you haven't, please sub to the channel. And if you like this video, just smash that like button. Uh, also, check out these videos that are just circling around me right here. You stay classy, all right? Yeah, yeah, you.